Hi there, in this video let's take a look at the solution to example number two which asked us to convert 3.782 millivolts to volts. Okay, so we're going from the millivolt unit up to volts, there's no prefix, so it's the midpoint of the on our number line, 10 to the zero, and um, we know that we have to move from the smaller to the bigger unit, in other words, we're going in the divide direction. All right, so 3.782 millivolts, we need to divide that by 10 to the power, well, we can see the distance between negative three and zero is three, we need to make three jumps to get from the one unit to the other unit. And what is that going to be equal to? Well, I'm going to do that on a calculator. Um, 3.782, you can time, um, type that in, divided by 10, raise that to the exponent of three, and you'll get 0 0.003782. So that is 0 0.003782. H2 and the new units are now volts. And we can see just in this very simple example why it makes sense that we have to go into the divide direction. Millivolts are smaller units than volts, so when moving from the smaller unit to the bigger unit, we expect the actual number to get smaller. In fact, it does exactly that.